A traveling art show is showcasing paintings created by artists with different types of dementia. Now, it's called Memories in the Making, and the pieces are being sold to help raise funds for the Alzheimer's Foundation. News 5's Jess Cabretto joining us live from Springs Ranch Memory Care with much more on this this morning. Good morning, Bree and Ira, and you can see some of the colorful and vibrant paintings created by folks living with Alzheimer's and dementia. Next to each painting, you'll find an information card with the artist's picture, a little bit of about them, a little bio, um, some of their thought process that went into the artwork, and also the title that they decided to give these pieces. And I'm actually joined by Jean Bautista. She helped organize this, uh, this traveling art show. So Jean, mm -hmm. how important is it for folks living with dementia and Alzheimer's? to paint and to just be involved in, in participating in artwork and that sort of thing. One of the beauties of the program is that it gives them the ability to reconnect with themselves through this process. We give them time to sit down every week, a blank piece of paper. Most of us get hung up looking at a blank piece of paper. One of the gifts that you can get from a horrible, horrible disease is to be able to get the freedom to fill that space. And it's almost like they can communicate through their brush strokes sometimes. They do. In fact, um, they're able to express feelings. They're able to get some of their thoughts out or in a place where they cannot articulate their thoughts. Um, these brush strokes do give them the ability to get that out. And um, talk to me about how folks can purchase these paintings, how many are up for sale. We have 34 framed pieces, some of which are already sold. This is a traveling art show, and so we're going around. We also have 45 other matted pieces. The framed pieces are $150 each, and the matted pieces are $40. These pieces are a way that the residents can give back to a cause that will ultimately, hopefully, benefit us all. And those funds can help with research and um, finding a cure, hopefully. That's right. It supports families as well as trying to work for a cure. Awesome. Thanks so much, Jean. And the artwork here will be on display through Monday. Then it will be traveling elsewhere and it will end up at the library for a month. So it will be on display throughout Colorado Springs through late October. Always watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Jessica Barreto, News 5.